Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is uh, one of our featured matches this evening. Vader will take on Mr. 47 for the Interstate Championship. And uh, I can't really call this one, Dave. I mean, yeah, th these two guys are hard hitting. They've had so much momentum as of late. Um. I mean, Vader got this opportunity by pinning Nightmare, if you remember, in that Three Stages of Hell match. Um, I think this was for the this was the first fall, I believe, if I remember right. Yeah, I mean, Three Stages of the Hell the... match. That was our final bar, was it not? Um, I think it was before. I think it was the uh, um, was it Defiance, and then because they had that last man standing, didn't they? Uh, um, final battle <clears throat> where they were both working injured but we didn't know until afterwards <laughs> and here we go ladies and gentlemen and Dave I can't help but I know we've got to move on here but that was a great match between Dangerous Man and Virus there but a lot of fans online disappointed about the outcome of that match and you know I feel I suppose the same in, in a way. I mean, it's it was a great match. It was back and forth. But I suppose we've got we're now at deadlock, and the championship scramble's been activated here. And once again, I have no unearthly idea what the hell is going to happen in that match. I mean, I mean, I petitioned to say if Infinity survives that match, then the next time Infinity should be defending the championship, should be a uh, kill the world. Yeah. I mean, now that we've finished the labyrinth, they've like that concludes the labyrinth now, but. I mean, what? Who do you think had the best performance in the labyrinth? I mean, I would say Dangerous Man, maybe Tornado. I'd probably um, say Tornado. Every match Tornado had was yeah. It mm -hmm. Just you, yeah. It got you in the feels every time. And I think that's the thing. Virus, if you've noticed, Davis had good matches with everybody. You know, he had a good match with Tornado, he had a, a decent match with Nick Knightley. He had a great match tonight with D-Man. Um, I think the only person he didn't fare very well against was Devil, but... I mean, the Labyrinth is always going to be hard to beat, Dave. That's why no one's done it. You know, Nick Knightley fell as well, and Devil and Tornado. But, um... Here comes the Interstate Champ now. Mr. 47, eh? The Forgotten Names. Yeah, Mr. 47. I haven't seen him since uh, the Chamber either, actually. Um, came out last in the Chamber, but couldn't gain any kind of uh, ground in the match of course and been a few weeks since we've seen him here and he's now got to defend his interstate title here against a, well, a worthy challenger former national champion as well a, a, a behemoth of a, of a, a I wouldn't really call him a human invader I, I can't can't call any of these matches tonight, but I mean, yeah, this is going to be a smash mouth style. I mean, we've seen a lot of wrestling in that last match between Demon and Virus, but this is not going to be. You're not going to see these two chain wrestling, that's for sure. They are just going to beat the hell out of each other. The last ever CWF champion, Mr. Forty Seven. You're hearing as well, Dave. 
along with 47 defending tonight, uh, Nightmare will be defending the national title on Super Fight as well. And we're hearing that um, Phoenix is cashing in his title opportunity Damn. against Nightmare in Super Fight as well. Remember he got a title shot after beating Samurai. Oh, I'm so Fucking Phoenix is going up for us. <laughs> <laughs> I know Phoenix is going up for other night. Oh man. I don't think so, I think fucking... Oh ho ho! And Vader's going up for us. <laughs> you see? You see his mask popping? I'm fucking putting his bow head <laughs> Oh my god. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh. I'm not Oh, German super, it's beautiful. And Dave, you know, for Saker and Fight have had unprecedented hype over the last few weeks. Our viewership has um, never been bigger, so if you thought if you're doing this, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for being part of GFW. It's just getting bigger and better each week. Yeah, like we were saying, we, we just finished recording online exclusively the, G, the GFW Forsaken's King of the Mountain Tournament 1. You can go over to GFW Forsaken YouTube channel and you will check that out. Yeah, King of the Mountain was a bit of a surprise show. Uh, that was uh, that aired today. You know, it's, uh, I've not even seen it yet. Can I? Oh, oh, Vader! Oh, your hand! Hi. And Dave, we thought this event's just dominated. The other state division since we're in the title. I mean, he's knocked off Shadow. He's knocked off the likes of Paul Tinsley. But I mean, Vader is a different animal, right? I mean, he's. He has just been, he's also been on a, a row since um, coming here and, oh my god. You've got to be oh, kidding me. How are, he's going up, I told you. <laughs> <laughs> he's, oh. he, he's met him with he can bother me. <laughs> oh, oh. Here, I might actually be looking to wrap this up already. Wait a minute. Oh, he's oh. setting up a contract. I'm in the ring! Connects! Contract! Oh! God, he was... He wasn't far away there. <laughs> the Outer State title on the line here, folks. Oh my god, 37 showing his. Wow! Inhuman power. That is unbelievable. Invaders. This is this is where 47 is dangerous for once he starts to build up momentum it's hard to stop him, he's like a freight train. Yeah, yeah. Um, I mean we've seen him already as well, but I mean who can forget him a few weeks ago he pinned the GFW champion as well. In a one on one match before the uh, before revolution as well. Yeah. And that's why we thought the momentum was with him, but the competition is just so stiff in GFW though, it's crazy. Well, you never, you know, count out infinity. That's just not what you do. Oh, wait a minute here, what is Vader got called? Vader bomb! Oh, god damn it! Oh, oh, oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> <laughs> that is dangerous. Oh, I think he's just going to tell you it's over here. And I thought he said he's going back to Forsaken on new contract. <laughs> Any pun intended, dudes. Oh, God. Jesus Christ, that is dangerous. You can know really that we're in there, dudes. It's that's tough. Almost a it's tough. That's almost a giant thing to steal with the steps. Swing <laughs> <laughs> it! I'm going to that, dudes. Jesus. Oh my god, seriously? 
After oh. that power bomb doing all the ropes, <laughs> that's what he was doing. <laughs> you see, you see, see what are on the on the outside of the fucking the ring. My oh. God, look at this power deadlift. Jesus. Power slam. Oh, these guys are just unloading here. He's there now, just that ability just to recover. Like superhuman. Fight really is the land of the giants here, Nick. Like, between, you know, 47, Goliath, Vader, Nightmare, Shadow. Yeah, there's a lot of guys in there. These guys are just, they're so like, cool. next level. They're just physical freaks. In a lot of ways. Oh look at this power. Paul yeah. Tumblr. Oh. You know, yeah, Dante, I mean. The list goes on and on. You've got to be kidding me, look at these. Every move is a fine <laughs> pack. <laughs> Forty seven. Like he said, he, that's why we call him the freight train. He just once that momentum starts, it's really hard to derail him. Yeah, you just can't stop him. I mean He's so focused. Oh contract I think reversed. Oh. oh, a minute now. Oh, Diesel. Oh, motherfuckers! <laughs> he's he's hit Bobbin. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh my God! But these guys, they can't, they can't get an advantage on one another here. Oh, oh hold on! We see the blood seeping through Vader's mask. Yeah. A knee caught right on the bridge of the nose. Yeah, caught him flush and oh, and opened up here. Huge over the head, belly to belly. I think a minute ago this might set him up here. 37. Look, I'm locked on target. Oh, my god. What? Super bulge oh, lands. <laughs> oh. oh I avoided that or not there, but I don't think Vader knew much about that either. I mean, he was out on his feet. I don't think Vader knows where he is. Oh, Jesus. Um, contract. The front, the front contract now. That's put, usually puts everyone away. Whoa, what? what? Holy crap. Oh my god, what is for this? Oh, this dragon sleeper. Oh my oh god. god! Oh wait a minute! He made him talk! Wow! That, hey. that, that, nose, that nose might be broken by that mask, Nick. Yeah. I mean, I don't think he was trying to unmask him. I think he was actually, he was trying to make him... ...submit. He maybe he maybe he 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 ...pulling on that broken nose. <laughs> 47 the teams, I mean, still. Interstate champion. The dominance I thought it's even showed there, Nick, at the end is scary. Yeah. A apart from that box spear lead. <laughs> 47 trip, 47 trip. <laughs> 47 <laughs> eggs. <laughs> 47 <laughs> eggs. The, the fan had the shoelace. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um. <clears throat> well, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our. Main event. Main event here, and uh, subsequently, um, these two men in this main event are going to be part of the uh, championship scramble, Dave, along with Nick Knight, oh, Dangerous Man, of course, the DFW champion in um, Infinity. And, uh, 
this is going to be an interesting match. I mean, we've seen last week, Dave, that these guys couldn't really co um, exist um, as a tag team when they took on D-Man and Infinity in that match. Pardon me. Yeah, that's because Devil doesn't like anybody. It's kind of the trait of, you know, the family belongs to him. What are you saying, son? She yell from the audience. <laughs> Slapping um, Nick's head to half again. <laughs> Mind that, I your, your brother don't come to you neither, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Well, yeah, I mean, that's the thing, Dave. I mean, we don't have to really recap now on uh, the labyrinth and state of emergency. That's over, but, you know, the reason that we had to have the labyrinth and state of emergency on those other shows is because there was a lot going on you know you had scheduling conflicts you had time constraints you had contractual obligations with D-Man and Devil involved and it's all come down to this now Devil here in the main event of fight massive yeah, two of the five participants now in the, the scramble and Dave now that we've kind of the dust settled a little bit I mean we're all still reeling from what happened earlier but you, you, I suppose in a match like the scramble you can't really there's no favourites in this is there I mean okay well Infinity has already won the chamber match I, I understand that but to ask him to do it again, he, he, he can't be favourite, surely. I'd say on that merit alone of winning the Revolution Chamber match, that he is the favourite. I think Infinity is on the roll of his career, and like, I don't think there's anyone on the roster currently that is on a good a, a good role. I mean, Oscar was, but his grandfather made sure that came to an end. You know, an angel's close. Damn you right, son. Can you see? You're doing a voice <laughs> note. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> you know, I think angel's close <laughs> with what angel's uh, doing. We can be filled with the, with the cruiserweight title. But, like, Infinity is... I'd say Infinity is probably the best in the business right now, like, I think. And I think that arcs devil. Devil being the face of the company. But yet... Uh, not holding gold. Do you think, Dave, that Devil? I mean, he can also. He's got a special up. He's got a special contract. You know, we know that he can also go for the global title as well if he wants to. But do you think that that's what the why Devil's been in such a foul mood lately? Is because he maybe thought he was going to have free reign over the the world titles and that's not really came to pass has it? Well no because remember he returned when the, the global title became vacant he came back early from the sabbatical because he wanted to be part of the first global title yeah. match you know and he came up short and now he's came across to fight to go for the GFW title now and he's followed Infinity across you know Infinity who beat him for the global title in the first place and he, he tripped at the, you know, at the labyrinth and now he has a shot, you know, at Hard to Kill, the GFW title match, which I'm being told now is the main event of Hard to Kill. Oh, wow. Mm. The, 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 scra the, the scramble match or with the, 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 the Iron Man rules type thing in, in a battle royal situation, you know, he has a, a good a chance as any of them like, to become global champion. Would you have to go champion somewhere? Huh? But I, I, I believe the way Devil is just now, it's, he's probably the most focused he's ever been since being champion himself, when he was crowned face of the company. Well, David, let, let me put this to you. Whilst Devil and Tornado, the match gets underway here. I was going to ask you earlier, do you think if Dangerous Man fought Infinity right now, as both, you know, participants, Taking into consideration the form, could Dangerous Man 
I suppose I've got two questions here for you. Can Dangerous Man be Infinity one-on-one? -on -one? And the second question is, do you think any of these men can be Infinity one-on-one -on -one at the moment? Tomato, Devil or McKnight was uh, included in that. In that uh, question. Well, you see, oh, God. I think... Wow. That's like a second like standing version of his tornado kick. Yeah. But you know, I'll answer the first one first. Dangerous man could be anyone on any day, no matter what. We know this. The D-Man's form as of late has been a bit yo-yo, shall we say. Like, remember the match he had against Devil on the main event of Forsaken? Oh yeah, who could forget? That was a classic. You know, and he won. You know, and then at the chamber he comes out, you know, he debuts this Conqueror character, he dominates the match, or he eliminates people, and then he, he takes three finishers on the steel to put him away. Yeah. You know, and tonight, he took a, he, he took a pounding from Virus before he actually went down. Oh yeah, I mean, Virus was yeah. coming from all angles as well, and this, that's what he does. Oh my god! Tornado oh, did it as a game to the coder. He could have seen that instead of the emergency. Oh. set up the, the tornado kick. Yeah, what's the second oh. time he's used that before the... He's sending a message to Tyson. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> you see, it was yeah. so cool. Ambition can be in the main event tonight. Oh, he's just a... God, and... And, like, there. as on, like, off the back of everyone else, right? One wonder of British Infinity. Can Nick Nettle defeat Infinity? Yes, he can. Can he defeat Infinity right now, the way Infinity is? I don't think so. Yeah, not from what we've seen lately. Devil. The Devil beat Infinity. Probably. The Devil beat Infinity right now. We've yet to see it. You know, Tornado's the only one oh. that I can't say definitively that he can beat. Infinity right now. Even though Tornado got the furthest in, in, in the labyrinth, he's still the, you know, the what, what do they call it, the dark sheep, the, you know, the one that you don't yeah. know. The dark sheep, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, hold on. The DKO. Oh, and Tornado there. We both got a finisher here. It's a DKO versus a Twister tonight. That's the thing, Dave. I mean, you're going to ask me now, you know, who could beat Infinity when I'm one out of these men. I, I honestly do not know. I mean, I had predictions in the labyrinth, you know, secretly, that I'm never going to tell anybody about. And I was completely wrong. You know, did I think Tornado would be the best performer in the labyrinth? Hell no. And that's going to be respect for Tornado. Oh! And you, you, you tell you, what we've seen is Tornado has never won a global title. The other men have, in their faces of GFW. And to really like perform them in the labyrinth, you know, so it's... I've got just, a devil. You just don't know, look at devil, yeah. You, you see, Confidence Tornado won. almost, you know, became the first ever global champion. Almost. You know, devil almost won. The uh, sorry, tornado almost won the oh, oh almost won the um ladder. You know, tornado's kind of becoming that almost guy. Yeah. You know, exactly like Dave Tyson. He, he's <laughs> yeah. always there, but he never quite reaches it, and that's uh, that's ironic because yeah. both their careers are a parallel. You know what I mean? Yeah. Dave Tyson's a 13 time world TV champion and 11 of those times that he's lost a title, he's lost it to the, to the <coughs> Tornado, yeah. who is an 11 time TV oh. champion, you know, so it's hard to, oh, to count Tornado out completely. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But I mean... Wow, oh my Devil God. was an emphatic victory over tonight. Wow. I was just going to say that if we all know that Tornado likes to steal, um, use other people's finishers on them, and that's where that came from. He was feed with Tyson, and he just kept doing it lately, but that wasn't enough tonight. This Devil has... 
beating Tornado here one on one. Devil oh. building the momentum now going into Hard to Kill with this huge victory over Tornado in the main event of fight tonight. Look at Tornado now rolls out the ring, he's looking at Devil here, holding his hand over his mouth. And look at this now, we're, look, we're going backstage, Nick Nitro on the monitor here. And the neck braces. Looking at, <laughs> looking, at, um, <laughs> looking at Devil here, and his dangerous man now. Also watching this match. Looking like he's just had a shower and oh well, there's Infinity now. Wow. On the moment they're all watching this match. <laughs> and ladies and gentlemen, we have to leave you here. What a oh, monumental night. Um Dave, this is be a shocking night, I have to say, and We'll see you next week, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, Vivictus is on Monday night. And Superfight Labyrinth will be on Friday night. Mm. Follow our website for any TV specials. Remember to tune in for the King of the Mountain special that aired earlier today. And from me and Dave, so long, everybody. Holy shit.